Right now at 6, a local mom is calling out Gaston County Schools for how it handles sexual assault cases. We thank you for sticking with us. I'm Vanessa Rufus. And I'm Colin Mayfield. She says her daughter was attacked at Churlville High School this month. And when her daughter went to school, administrators uh, to them, she says they didn't believe her or try to help. WCNC Charlotte Julia Kaufman live now from Gaston County with this story. Julia. Yeah, a Gaston County freshman pulled out of school and traumatized. She says she was sexually assaulted by a classmate, but when she reached out for help, she says school administration made things worse. Been pretty rough. Miranda Black is standing up for her daughter. You have to have somebody that'll step out there and say, this is not okay. She alleges the Churville High School resource officer and assistant principal did not believe her daughter. It hurts me because... <sighs> Hurt, feeling like her child was not safe at school and further traumatized <sighs> for coming forward. Oh, sorry. Black says the SRO called her when he learned about the alleged assault. He said if he didn't see it happen on camera that he was filing a falsified police report charge on her. Her daughter remained in class with the boy for several days. Black says a counselor never reached out. They didn't even try to help her. At the end of the week, she unenrolled her daughter from school. Believe the child, even if it doesn't sound like something that could have happened. Ann Glazer with Pat's Place says they've created steps for schools to follow when a child reports assault. You don't want to have a reaction that will scare the child away or stop the child from sharing. They have chosen you because they trust you or they know you can help. Gaston County Schools says the school investigated the incident and notified law enforcement. In a statement, a district spokesperson says, quote, the school has not received information or evidence to confirm that a sexual assault occurred at school. No charges have been filed at this point, but Black plans to file a formal complaint against the SRO. I hope that he learns that this is not the way that you speak to a sexual assault victim. Black hopes her family's story will prompt change in how schools handle sexual assault reports. She says they aren't pressing charges for now because her daughter is scared to face the boy in court. Live at Gaston County Schools, Julia Kaufman, WCNC Charlotte.